Kyle, can't is an ugly four-letter word. We, we don't believe in that word at all. Mm -mm, it's not acceptable. Mark Parker from Parker Brothers Choppers. A professional grease monkey. Uh, I burn myself and cut myself about 20 times a day for a living. And somehow in the midst of it, I make really weird motorcycles that people like. Uh, we started building like when we were little kids bicycles and go-karts and motorcycles and you know pretty much anything we'd get our hands on uh, we started the business Parker Brothers actually started up about six six or seven months ago the, the uh, replica that we did from the latest Batman movie that one's kind of the one that really put us out there to doing the really strange stuff you know before that it was just regular bikes like everybody else was doing and uh, and we had success with it but the the really unique and weird stuff seems to be best for us. We just finished the Bat Pod, and it was, you know, on the internet. People were liking it and everything, and we were looking for something to kind of outdo the Bat Pod, something that would take it to the next level, because we don't want to settle for, okay, we're good with this, let's just stay with that. We want to find that next big thing. And we saw a couple of pictures online of the you know, previews from the movie and everything, and found out that they'd never actually used movie, uh, m used bikes in the movie. It was all CGI and whatnot, because everybody said it was an unbuildable bike. So right there, that's all we needed to hear. You know, if it can't be built, we've got to build it. So, you know, any kind of challenge like that just drives us. So we sat down and started sketching some stuff out on paper, getting some dimensions, and uh, took us about a half hour. We had the whole bike designed and started building it. Well, they've got Suzuki uh, motors in them. It's a V-twin 1,000cc TL motor. Top speed's probably going to run somewhere in the 120 to 130 range. Um, zero to 60, you know, three and a half to four seconds, something like that. It's quick. It's, it's you know, pretty fast. We built a 24-inch hubless wheel, and instead of having one bearing, we've got a series of 24 separate bearings that float throughout the rim and dissipate the weight and with that we've got a, a speed rating somewhere around 120 130 miles an hour and rpm somewhere in the 17,000 rpm range so i doubt anybody's ever going to test that somebody may i don't know i may it's we, we kind of like to over engineer things you know if, if i need it to go 100 miles an hour i want to make it to go 200 miles an hour